Lex here at Board at Work, and we're coming to you from Barcelona at Mobile World Congress. Um, this is the Huawei P10. We're going to do a small unboxing, a little bit of a hands, hands on of the device. It was announced by Huawei. And we're just going to get right into it. Uh, first off, very cool box by Huawei. Um, it kind of just opens up like so. I kind of wanted to keep it like that just so you kind of get a gist of it. Um, but taking a look at the device itself, this is the Huawei P10. So put that aside for right now. The usual placeholder for the device. Put that on the side. Open up this box here. And it seems a bit hefty, so we'll actually look into it. It might be more than paperweights. Let's see. Uh, open this up. Okay, so there is more. Uh, Huawei does provide you with a case for the uh, P10, which is very nice to see. Uh, let's see here. Uh, opening up this box as well. Uh, push it up like so and see what you get. So on this side, you get the, okay, this is the micro type C, no USB type C uh, charging cable. And then you have your headphone jack because the P10 does include a headphone jack, which is a rarity these days. Um, so opening up this here, and then you get your European style kind of charging supercharger adapter. So this does do quick charge. Uh, which is pretty standard on somewhat mid-range to high tiered spec devices um but that's pretty much it for the unboxing and we're gonna get right into the hands-on okay taking a look of the p10 turned on very nice display and pretty simple it's a 5.1 inches 1080p the p10 plus has a 5.5 inch with a qhd display but very similar stuff here guys um now i do have the fingerprint all scan up i believe if it works there you go um but it is pretty nice um, in terms of Overall speed and gist of the device, it's running the octa-core Curin processor uh, from Huawei and from past experiences that processor is no slouch, so pretty good there. But it is running on the Emotion UI from Huawei, um, which in itself is uh, optional. I mean, you can definitely customize that with Android, but if it's your taste, it's your taste. They do have this new uh, machine learning technology that's based in the, the operating system to kind of learn your habits and give you tips and do things for you on your behalf. But um, that's again machine learning and not anything AI based um, but this is running in 64 gigs of uh, memory you do have 4 gigs of RAM um, and you do have the again the dual you know lens camera system on the back but this is just a hands-on guys at first glance this seems like a nice solid device for about 649 US dollars I believe um, and um, it seems that the aesthetic is very similar to again the iPhone I just can't get past that um, but very good at hand feel a very premium device um, and we're looking forward to get to the uh, the full hands-on review.